Uh, hi, this is Frank from Walking for Health and Fitness, and today's video is on the 11 reasons to love walking. Now, getting out and walking is so important, especially if you spend a lot of time indoors, as we are right now during this COVID-19 crisis. Now, even before the crisis, many people might have been reluctant to walk for exercise, you know, thinking that, well, that's something I only do when I'm on vacation. I'm right, right? All right. How many times have you gone on vacation, gone away, you take a nice walk after dinner, you get back from the vacation, and you're all refreshed, you're raring to go, you get back into the same routine at home and at work, and you're stressed out again. Maybe it was that daily walk that got you relaxed as much as it was being away on vacation. So have you ever thought about the mind-body connection and walking? Okay, so click my link below on my website and I have a lot of walking resources for you to put that into perspective, especially the starting out and getting out the door. So let's start with the 11 reasons to love walking. Number one, so important, you soak up the sunshine. Walking out in the fresh air feels easier and it's much more enjoyable than walking inside and working out in a stuffy gym. Now, sunshine causes the body to produce vitamin D, which is known as the sunshine vitamin. Your body was meant to be in the sun, and exposure to sunlight is a crucial component of good health and fitness and well-being. And there's several reasons for that. Now, walking in the sunlight is good for improving your mood. Now, sunlight increases levels of serotonin, which help promote the feelings of happiness. Uh, this is especially important in the winter when, we're, when there is limited sunshine. And also, if you spend a majority of your working day indoors, even in the summertime, if you're inside a lot, you're not getting that sunshine. Walking in the sunshine boosts your immunity. It's been proven that sunshine stimulates the immune system's vitamin D and T cells, which result in boosted immunity. Walking outside in the sunshine also reduces the risk of type 2 diabetes. Now, vitamin D plays a huge role in the production of insulin, and studies have shown a positive association between insulin resistance and vitamin D deficiency. Lower blood pressure. Research has shown that nitric oxide stored at the top layer of the skin reacts to sunlight, which causes blood vessels to widen as the oxide moves into the bloodstream. Walk, uh, walking in the sunshine helps with weight loss. Lack of sunshine can result in depression, which can affect your appetite. Sunlight increases your level of activity. Better bone health. Vitamin D actually helps our body better absorb calcium. Walking in the sunshine can cure depression. Now, exposure to sunlight has been linked to increased levels of natural antidepressants in the brain. The brain produces more serotonin on sunny days than on darker days. It improves brain function. Sunlight directly affects the brain's penile gland. It's the gland that produces melatonin, and that is a powerful antioxidant that's important for sleep quality and helps prevent depression. Seasonal affective disorder. Without enough sunlight exposure, a person's serotonin level can dip low. Low levels of serotonin are associated with a higher risk of seasonal affective disorder. Now, the number two reason to love walking is that aches and pains can catch you. Now, walking is like giving your joints a lube job. Synovial fluid is pushed into and out of the joints and helps circulate nutrition to our cartilage, which improves its function. As an added bonus, walking improves balance and endurance. The number three reason to love walking. 1,000 extra steps helps you lose weight. The American Journal of Health Promotion found that women who increased their daily step count by just 1,000, on average lost 2.1 pounds over nine months. Okay, the average person can hit 1,000 steps in just about a half mile. Okay, so just that little bit extra will help you lose weight. I click the link below for my post and uh, my infographic on does 1,000 steps keep the doctor away? So check that out. The number four reason to love walking, uh, tracking your steps and mileage is exciting. Uh, whether you use the iPhone health app, a Fitbit, or any other step tracking device, you'll stay motivated. And most of all, they'll prompt you to keep moving. Okay, I can't tell you the number of people who told me they, it's nighttime, they're ready to go to bed, and they're like 500 steps away from 10,000. They'll just walk around the house to get that extra steps in. So uh, having the tracking device really helps you stay motivated. 
The number five reason to love walking is that changing your walking routes changes your calorie burn. So when you're walking on flat terrain, you'll burn the least number of calories. But if you add walking up hills and climbing steps, you'll burn the most. Okay, so vary your routes to change the scenery and also to change your calorie burn. The so reason number six to love walking is that walking every day is powerful medicine. There's a lot to this point here. So brain function. Engaging in a brisk walk for 68 minutes or more a day may improve neuron health. Now that's according to a study in the Journal of Alzheimer's Disease. Walking helps you solve problems. Walking activates the powers of your superconscious mind by giving you the time to think and reap the psychological benefits that improve your health. Recent research led by the University of California at Los Angeles shows that taking a short walk each day can help to keep the brain healthy, supporting the overall resilience of cognitive functioning. Immune function. Walking briskly for 20 minutes a day, five days per week, results in a 43% fewer sick days than those who exercise once a week or less. That's according to research in the British Journal of Sports Medicine. Bone health. Women who walk four hours a week have a 41% lower risk of hip fracture than those who walk less than an hour a week, and that's according to a landmark study by the Nurses Health Study. Breast health. The American Cancer Society found that walking one hour per day lowered your risk of developing breast cancer after menopause by 14%. Mood. Walking just one hour per week could prevent 12% of all depression cases. Now it's according to a study by the American Journal of Psychiatry. A California State University at Long Branch study showed that the more steps a person took during the day, the better their moods were. Why? Well, walking releases natural pain-killing endorphins to the body. That's one of the emotional benefits of exercise. Now my book, Walking for Health and Fitness, has a whole chapter on this mind-body connection and the importance of the endorphins. Uh, check out the author interview right up there and uh, see for yourself why walking and fitness is the easiest way to get in shape and stay in shape and how important it is for your mood. So another reason why walking is powerful medicine is that it's, it's good for your heart health. Now regularly walking three miles per hour or faster can cut your risk of heart disease by half. Now that's compared with walking just two miles per hour or slower and that's according to a study in circulation. Below is a link to my uh, website article, Benefits of, of Fitness Walking, and that's three ways to build a strong body and heart. So check that out. And the number seven reason to love walking is that 15 minutes a day gives you more energy. Now, do you need to refocus your concentration in the afternoon? Just a mere 15 minutes of walking or climbing a few flights of steps is more energizing than consuming 50 milligrams of caffeine. And below is my article, Benefits of a 15-Minute Walk. Your life may depend on it. The number eight reason to love walking is that you'll never know when you'll find money on the road or any other interesting thing. Now, I found money on the road, actual dollars, uh, coins. It's amazing how a dime can wind up in a crack on the, in the uh, roadway. It, you know, where did it come from? I'm nowhere near a house and there's money. Uh, I once found 50 bucks, that was great, and I find golf balls all the time. I don't live anywhere near a golf course or walk anywhere near a golf course. Um, the most interesting thing I probably found was this. I found a golf ball that had the word money on it. I mean, how crazy is that, right? So up to date, I found, I found 50, uh, 21 golf balls at this point uh, through my walking. I keep them as souvenirs. I don't know what I do with them. Uh, anyway, mostly though, in walking, I found myself, while I'm out on the road, deep in my thoughts, and that walking is great for that. Uh, check out my video, where is it, right up here, uh, What's Your Why? And there's a whole three-part series on What's Your Why and on motivation to get you out and walking. The number nine reason to love walking. It's easy to tone when you're on the road. Uh, so add one or more of the following body weight movements and you add metabolism boosting power to your next walk. So try push-ups, lunges, squats, planks. Check out my author interview on my second book, Fitness Walking and Body Weight Exercises. This book shows you how to supercharge your fitness 
by incorporating walking and body weight fitness exercises. It's available in paperback and on the Kindle platform. The number 10 reason to love walking is that it helps you develop a deeper connection to others. Now, when you walk with a significant other, you tend to walk similarly. This is called synchronous movement, and that alone can increase rapport and strengthen your relationship. Walking encourages conversation about the more difficult stuff we face in life. And the number 11 reason to love walking is walking gives you greater confidence. Now, according to a study published in the journal Body Image, it found that people who walked in nature were more likely to feel good about their bodies. Okay, so choose at least one of these 11 reasons to love walking. Get out there, get on a walk. Down below is a link to my web uh, page article, my blog post on 11 reasons to love walking. So check that out and read it. Also check out the books that I have available on Amazon. I've created a trilogy of walking books that cover all aspects of how walking will improve your life. Book number one, Walking for Health and Fitness, will give you a great overview of the benefits of walking. It's the easiest way to get in shape and stay in shape. Um, I, I pointed that out in the video earlier. Check out the link below. Now book number two that I have is Fitness Walking and Body Weight Exercises. It'll show you how to supercharge your fitness by incorporating walking and body weight fitness exercises. I pointed that out earlier in the video. There's also a link below. And my third book, Walking Inspiration will help improve your mindset with uh, motivational quotes. Each month will take one topic and all the quotes for that month will help you focus on that topic. Again, it's a way to really improve your mindset through walking, through exercise. Um, check out the author interview above right there, give you more information. Check out my website. Walking for Health and Fitness, uh, if you sign up for my mailing list, I have a great number of giveaways for you that really show the um, power of walking, what a great exercise it is for your body and for your mind connection. Okay, so this is Frank, walk on.